In Eastern and Southern Africa, there are 59 million children of school going age who should be in school but are not in school. That is a tragedy. The major reason why children are not going to school is poverty. Comfort is the international non-profit tackling poverty and inequality through girls' education. Educating a girl breaks the cycle of poverty in the sense that their children, their family members will not depend on external support to access education, to access medical services. Because for every year that a girl is educated, they increase their income by 10 to 20 percent. They also reinvest 90 percent of their income back into their families. Comfort serves the neediest children, the most marginalized, the least reached. And that's why even in terms of schools, you know, selection, we go to the schools where there is the lowest enrollment rates of girls. So for us, it's always driven by where the need is the greatest, where there is the least service provided as well. We're working in Ghana, Malawi, Zimbabwe, Zambia, and Tanzania. Comfort provides for all the school-going costs that are material that parents cannot bear. Comfort does not create new schools. We work through the government structures. So Comfort works in public schools. I was grade 6. My mother was in grade 6. I was in grade the Kama Network is a network of young girls who have received support from Comfort. It was formed in Ghana in 2000, but it was officially launched in 2002. We find ourselves in a society where everyone is able to fish out what a problem is, but we don't have those to solve them. And that is the principle of Kama, bringing up young ladies, hardworking, with different skills, come together and make our community a better place. We have Kama members who are now doctors, lawyers, teachers, nurses, clinical officers. We offer business training for these young women. The encouragement is for the young women to have some financial skills so that they can start some small businesses. I produce babies uh, Tom Brown for sale. It's a nutritious food. We use it when prepare porridge. So the Danny are Varney, a doing a Dan Bendidin, a year the bank. The major value for Karma is giving back. As people, we have also been assisted. They feel like they also need to be able to do the best they can to keep as many children as possible in school. At some mission effort to engage the business, eh? It's a good to pay a queen pia, he no no see. I change a thing to think. For a lot of them, they are the first generation in their communities or in their families to ever have made it through school. So they really are leaders bringing about change for girls and young women in their communities. And for me, when you look at the common numbers, it's what makes the biggest difference. You know, a network that was started with less than 400 young women to a network with over 150,000, and each, on average, is supporting three children. So it means that there are 450,000 additional children in school because of that initiative. Over the past two decades, Comfort has developed programs together with the young women that has been able to lift over one million girls out of poverty as a result of their education. And this is a generational change we are seeing. And so continuing on this path means that we have the opportunity to really change communities and change Africa as a whole. Jesus.